Hey guys, how's it going? It's Eclipse Shots here. Back to da 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 Dwarf. The other day I was looking at my Steam um, recommended or new and trendy games, I guess is the correct word. And at the top of the list, what do we see? Dwarf. And I looked at it and I looked like, and I, well, look like, what am I saying? Thought it was uh, right up my alley. In the massive hollow mountain of Mount Crowcrest, there once lived a great nation of dwarves. The dwarves discovered power stones while mining deep in the mountain. They used them to power machines and eventually entire cities. They lived in peace and prosperity for centuries. Over time, they became infatuated with the power stones and dug deeper to find more. One day, they dug too deep and unleashed the gloom dark hordes, an army of trolls and monstrous creatures. Once the dwarves realized that trolls turned to stone in the sunlight, they fled far from the mountain and found refuge on the sunny hills of Brecca. Centuries passed and over time, the dwarves forgot their traditions and abandoned craftsmanship and innovation in favor of warring and raiding. History became myth, and myth became bedtime stories. But whispers of a long forgotten darkness echo throughout the valley of the great mountain. It can be heard in the snoring forest by those who dare to enter. <clears throat> Gosh, my ability to speak is horrible, guys. Sorry about that. Hopefully I did justice to this. Guess we'll find out. The snoring forest. I guess I'm this blue-haired guy. What was that? <laughs> I guess this is a uh, Ari. Ari. I'm gonna say Ari. I'm gonna say Ari. I like Ari better. Um, dwarf. We shouldn't be here. What are you even looking for, anyways? She must have lost something. Some cloche. Did you hear that? Something moved in the trees. Oh, I wish we didn't come here again. The storing forest is full of <laughs> it's full of vicious creatures, and you can't even fight with that little crafting hammer. If we run at any wild creatures, we're done for. Come here. Hide my bag if you're so scared. Oh, I have to use my arrow keys, dude. What? Hold up. Hold up, guys. I haven't even uh, I haven't even uh, done this yet, so it's really difficult for me to tell you. Um, what I'm doing here. Let me just rebind my keys really fast. Okay, I I don't know why they made that there because obviously E and R like, well, well, anyways. <laughs> there we go. Beep the bop boop beep bop. Oh, okay. Ah, run, run. <laughs> Dwarf, don't die. I'm gonna help. <laughs> I'm gonna get help. Yeah, see, a lot of this really didn't make any sense in the sense that um, I could walk around so easily. Son, you're awake. Praise the kings, you're all right. I told you never go to go into the snoring forest. Your mother went in there and never came back. Had I not found you when I did, you would have died. Forgive my anger, son. I don't know what I would do if anything ever happened to you. Oh. Well, I better go back to Brecca Village. Chief Tane and the other warriors went to raiding this morning. He assigned me to guard duty again. Mm. <clears throat> I'll be home for dinner. See you tonight, son. Wow, my dad's my dad's so cool. <laughs> what is this? Hmm? Grandpa's workbench. Always nice and tidy. Huh? Grandpa has been tinkering with these weapons for ages. Okay, cool. Yo, I see a coin over there in the far left. Do I have a cursor? No, I don't. Hi, partner. Oh. Who are you? Esben. Did you hear? Did you go looking for your mother again? Oh, oh of course you did. You're just like her. Mm. I suspect this won't be the last time you sneak into the forest, snoring forest. Mm -hmm. Come, let me at least teach you how to defend yourself. Meet me in the field. Alrighty. Ooh, okay. Hey, partner. Oh. Hold up. Let me grab this coin really quick. I saw it over here. I'm gonna forget about it. Think. 
I don't know what those coins do, but I got a coin. Is there one on this side too? That's my question. Still not dry. Hope there's one back here. I don't know what these coins do, guys, but I'm gonna snag them up. Um, I will tell you this: when I was playing this, uh, when I looked at the menu earlier, my biggest problem that I saw was that um, the menus might be a little bit weird. So keyboard and mouse mouse might not have been the intended play here. Us dwarves are very clever, but also very slow. This makes us weak against multiple foes. That's why the warriors of the old days became warsmiths. Warsmiths were artisans of war that are engineered magnificent turrets and traps powered by magical stones. Their mechanical weapons would do the fighting for them. A single warsmith could best a dozen warriors. Some stories say even a hundred. And believe it or not, your great grandparents, my mother and father, were warsmiths during the Great Exodus. The creatures of Snoring Forest will surely outnumber you. If you're to survive out there, you must become a warsmith, so I will teach you as my parents taught me. Let's see if you can handle a turret. Get the spin blade turret from the chest. The chest? Oh. Howdy. A uh, spin blade turret is a melee weapon that continuously damages all enemies around it with spinning its blades. Turret cannon function without power stones. Cannot function without power stones. Nowadays, they are the thing of great rarity. Luckily for you, I've kept the ones my parents passed down to me. I had two more power stones lying around somewhere, but I can't seem to find them. I wonder where they went. No matter. I'm sure they'll come up. Anyway, get the two power stones from the other chests, then build a spin blade turret next to the training dummy. From the other chest. Wow, make me run across the whole map. Ha! Okay, that was a little bit off. <clears throat> ha! Those blades will rip through more than just hay. However, now you have no power stones left. You can't build turrets without power stones. Don't worry, power stones can't be destroyed by any means. You'll get the power stones back when a turret gets destroyed or when you recall it. Recall your turrets by pressing space, then destroy the remaining training dummies. Ah! Ah, uh, what was it again? Okay, it's Q. Oop, okay. I had to go. Sir! 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 That, that's wrong! Uh, uh, okay. I'm confused. That's my grandson. Looking like a warsmith already. Hmm. Now what else is there? Ah, uh, yes. Artifacts. They're legendary items crafted by warsmiths that give you special abilities. Here, take my father's bone cracker boomerang. It gives you a ranged auto attack to support your turrets from a safe distance, but you need to stand still in order to throw it. And last but not least, take my mother's dashing boots. These let you dash uh, by pressing left shift. More, many more artifacts were crafted, but they remain lost in Mount Crowcrest. Now, it's time to see how you do against the enemies that fight back. While you were recovering from your wounds, a swarm of bee fairies infested my brewery. Been drinking all my delicious honeydew mead. Follow the path to the brewery and stop them before they drink all my honeydew mead. I've just brewed a fresh batch. Why would you want to drink your gross erm? Um, I mean, you can count on me, Grandpa. <laughs> Already. Uh, While well, standing still, Dwarf automatically throws the bo Bone Cracker Boomerang at the closest enemies, dealing 10 damage. Dashing Boots. Dashing Boots let Dwarf dash through the turrets and enemies, deal 20 damage and knock, and one knock back to foes. Oh. Okay, I'm literally not doing anything. He's just taking these down all by himself. Come on now. Okay, I, I have quite a bit to actually take care of. Okay, interesting. I'm gonna, if I can get money to smash it, hey, I'm smashing some hay. What can I say? Okay, we're not gonna worry too much about getting every single thing in this game, but um, I do like the, I do like the, I do like the dash around through things a little bit and see. What was it, where are my buttons again? Howdy. The space bar to recover. I'm totally gonna forget these keybinds and die, guys. No doubt in my mind. Yeah. 
<laughs> I just smacked the bush while waiting. So far, this is a pretty dope game. I like it. So far, so far. Ooh. Wreck a village? Wow, guys. Checkpoint reached. All right. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Smack it. Come on, bees. You got nothing on me. Oh, shit. Um. Uh -uh. <laughs> I think what would have been really cool is if they made it. Ooh. Okay, that, that's going to have to do. I think what would have been really cool is if they made it so that... Um, so that it was kind of like Stardew Valley, where when you go around and... Uh, oh, I didn't grab it. Ow. Uh, I wish it was kind of like Stardew Valley, where when you would walk around, um, your cursor would be what dictates what direction um you are uh you know aiming stuff i'm trapped in here now it'd be it'd be what dictates what where you're aiming and where you're putting stuff and obviously it's, it's on a tile based system this game at least i think it is like i could try to ooh, i could try to i could try to like inch over and see if it works but once i'm done fighting i'll give that a shot so far though Nice relaxing music. I like it. It's all pretty chill. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's on a tile based system. Okay, so right here where it is, let's see if I can pick it up and move it over like an inch. Yeah, see, it went to the right side. If I move back like a millimeter, it goes to the left side. Actually, it isn't on tile based. I don't know what it's on. But either way, though, it doesn't feel very, um,. Doesn't feel like super smooth. Howdy. Dorv, you're right. Boy, am I glad to see you up and about. I told him you'd be fine. About that. Thanks for getting my dad when I got knocked out. I nearly became war bore lunch. You really had me scared for a moment. Glad you're here, though. Those bee fairies had me trapped. Wait. Has uh, Espen finally taught you how to build turrets? No. He might have taught me a thing or two. Ari, have you been licking the mead barrels again? Well, I... I might have had a sip or... Uh, do I have a favor and don't tell Espen? Fine, I won't. Come, let's take care of the bee fairies swarming up back. I'm too dizzy to walk. Make some room in your bag for me. <laughs> nice. Ah, oh, it's nice and cozy in your bag. Thanks for the lift. Wow. What a leech. Kidding. <laughs> Grandpa's power stones. Ari, did you take them again? They're not toys. I borrowed them. I'm too short to reach the mead. I needed something to stand on. Well, I'll take them to Grandpa. He was worried that he lost three these stones. Sometimes guys, I can't speak, so you just have to deal with it. Nice, and a, oh, and full health, okay. Oh, they automatically get used, okay. Okay, we're just gonna come up and smack them down. This is gonna get destroyed. Had a partner. Bang! Smack that bee into a a bee beevian. Hee <laughs> hee. There's another beehive coming up. Oh, dude, that's not cool, man. Grab this one. Don't worry, guys. We're champion. Uh, whatever we are. What are we? <laughs> What are these things again? Let's go home. Quest complete. Checkpoint reached. Stash through that. Yeah. Uh, okay, that's the way we went. Let's go left. Grandpa! Wait, what's going on over there? 
Dwarf, look! The village is on fire! Dad! Dad is down there! Eric? Well, he will be alright. He's the best warrior I know. Alright, uh, what am I saying? We have to go down there and make sure he's alright. Yes, dang it! We're gonna make sure he's alright! <laughs> Grandson, come! We must hurry back to the house. The village is under attack. I... I can't. I have to go to Brecken and find Dad. Dwarf, are you sure you're going down there? I already lost mom. I can't lose dad too. You have your father's courage, Dwarf, and your mother's kind heart. She'll be proud of you, but you'll be safer if you can defeat foes from afar. Take my crossbow turret. It is a ranged turret that shoots high-speed bullets, but it is frail. So, it's best to place it behind the splint blade turret. A final lesson before you go. When you've built more than one turret, pay attention to which one you want to recall. You recall the closest turret in the direction you're facing. If you're not facing any turret, you simply recall the closest one to you. Hold space if you want to see which turret you will <laughs> you will get recalled. An indicator will appear above the turret. It won't get recalled unless you release the button. That is all I can teach you for now. Please take care of yourself. I wonder how far your father will go. Okay, great. Oh no, it's on my W key. Ah. Hold up. We're gonna fix this really quick. <clears throat> um. Hello? Um. Or I won't fix it because this game is silly. <laughs> uh, okay, we're just gonna put these back, I guess. I guess we're just gonna put these back. That's kind of annoying. Um, I might have to try using a controller or something. Oh, I can use my mouse. Well, that's cool and all, but that doesn't help my problem. Because I can't rebind the keys that, uh... Oops, cancel. I can't rebind... Oh, wait, I can. There's there's the key. I'm blind, guys. Hold up. Okay, and actually, we will put some of these keys on... Uh, um, my mouse. Because uh, if I'm not using my mouse, might as well, right? Sheesh. Um, and then we get another turret. I think I just want to put all these. We can do this. This one here. I'm going to put this one as my right mouse. And then we'll figure it out as we go. I have a couple more buttons on my mouse I could totally slap down. Um, but this totally works for the time being. Okay, cool. Continue. Not much I can do from up here. Wreck a village. No. What's down here? The village is down the stairs. Oop. Okay. Literally forcing me to go. Gotcha. I was gonna go explore a little bit, guys. <laughs> Can't help it. Okay. Ooh, who are you? I was about to start fighting him. John Ethan. Ahoy there! I saw great plums of, plumes of smoke rise from here. Your people must love bonfires. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, I come seeking direction. I am John of the Ethan. I'm trying to reach Seashine, where the best tasting fish are. But I got utterly lost. Tell me, young beardling, do you know where Seashine is? Mm -hmm. You're in luck. It's just north of here, uh, beyond Mount Crowcrest. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you, kind beardling. Here for your troubles. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help it. Okay, uh, we said right click was gonna be for this. Wants me to slap these down, but you know what? I'm going in. I can't help it. I want these to die quicker. Is this a bad idea? Maybe it is. We'll find out. Oops, that's crooked. Sorry, we're just gonna stand over here. That's a lot of nonsense. Uh oh. Slap it down again. Aha. Don't tell me this isn't how it's supposed to be played. Whoops. Take these back. Take these back. Okay, what is this? Praise the kings. I never understood why you say that. Dwarves don't even have a king. No, silly. We're, we worship the ancient kings from the time of the old kingdom. They always protect the dwarves. Even now, they watch over us. 
seems to me like you're bowing to wood and stones. Yeah, honestly? Sheesh. Get your shit together, man. No, so many dead. Wreck a village. What do we got here? Not a single troll lost during the raid. The dwarf clans have become weak, my queen. Our hordes will crush them. Lands deep shall be ours. Your scouts were right. Carve them up. The outside world is lush and fertile. Maybe a bit too bright now. It requires silence. Ooh. I think it's our main protagonist here, eh? There. The dim-witted dwarves will see elf fairies. Arrows. Blame them for a raid and wage war upon them. Let them weaken each other so our conquest may be swift. Warlord, unleash the war warg boars. Let them finish what we started. We must return to Hordal. There's more to work to be done. Yes, my queen. Your yeah, boys dig in. Shame to let that meat go to waste. Hee <laughs> hee. Sorry. Can't help it now. Now there's just a bunch of tee hees going on. All the time. Ooh, that was close. For a moment, I thought they saw us. Who are they? Hmm? Ari. They remind me of the trolls from Grandpa's stories. Could it be? What? Trolls? If they are trolls, why the heck haven't they turned to stone? I don't know. But in every tale, trolls look exactly like this. Maybe Dad knows. We must find him before the war boars do. They look fast. If they get close, press left shift to dash away from them. Okay. Uh, well, that's going to be problematic. We're going to set one here. And we're going to slap this guy down. Haha. -ha. We're standing here and help them. With my bow of doom. Actually, let's take this up again. We're gonna put it higher up on this road so that if by chance they happen to smash us, we can uh, hopefully uh, pick it up and move back. Yeah, hopefully at a good time I can pick this up. If not, I'm just gonna wait until it gets broken. I unironically don't think there's a good time. They're like literally evenly spaced. Nice. I think we got them all. Beautiful. Not even a single bit of damage done. What's here? Locked and barred. Huh. There's something behind this. I'm just gonna sneak a peek. Nope, okay. Huh? No one's even no use. Everyone's hiding now. Dad! Uh. Son! What are you doing here? The village is not safe. You should have stayed home with grandpa. Uh. I came to help you fight the trolls and their war boars. Those were trolls, right? Oh. I've never seen such creatures, but they must be trolls. Far too ugly to be elf fairies. Uh -huh. All those warg boars. Did you kill them? So Espen taught you how to fight with turrets. Well then, I could use your help. Huh. I never thought Espen's stories about trolls could be real. Now they've raided our village. I have to go make sure they're gone. Uh -huh. Since you know how to fight warg boars, find and destroy the remaining dens. Bingo, bango, bongo. Doesn't look like a problem to me, sir. You got it. It's showing me where all of them are, and I'll be honest, I completely lost track of it. <laughs> Instantaneously. Wait, take my tar trap. The tar is thick and sticky. It will slow down the warg boards. Uh, it's placed on the ground, so don't worry about it blocking your path. Traps will only require one power stone. Here, take mine. Don't worry, my axe will keep me safe. Remember, if they close in, just retreat and reposition yourself. Careful, my son. <clears throat> Oh, he's giving me an extra one. Fire, dude. Uh, the tar traps. The tar trap is a ground weapon that covers all enemies that walk over it. It's sticky tar, slowing them down for a short duration. Nice. Okay, this is my E now. Um, I can't go down. <clears throat> so, up it is. Press E. Okay. Oh, and they're going to force me to set up turrets. Okay, then. No, give it back. Oh, my gosh. Whatever. I'm stuck. Um, bro, that's not, they're not even helping, man. That ain't even helping, dog. Jeez. Okay, let me uh just pick all that up. I collect that from really far away. Locked, of course. Of course. 
Who would have thought otherwise? What's up here? Can I interact with anything? There's a coin up top. Ooh, there's a coin here. I'll have to try to remember that coin up there. Let's go down here and see what we can find. Howdy, partner. We good. We got these guys so far. Oh, there's more. There's bees coming too. Uh oh. This is uh, getting sticky very quick. We'll grab this guy up. We can totally slap this down now. Oops. There you go. We got them all. Let's go. All right. It looks like we can go inside here. So let's take a peek. These. <laughs> what? This lady's just chilling. Dwarf. Oh, wait, that's me. I thought it was the lady talking. Granny? Laris? <laughs> Hello? Excuse me. Oh, you startled me. You can't, uh, can't a woman crochet in peace. I came to check on you. Are you all right? Oh, kings, no. There's been so much ruckus today. Go tell everyone is <laughs> whoever is out there to keep it down. <laughs> And ask us been about to bring me some honeydew mead when a batch is ready. <laughs> okay, well. Cool. The armor is ancient, but it will protect me. Fantastic. Uh, what's up here? I mean, I'm just like walking through this lady's house, stealing her shit. Nice, a coin. Oh, you know what? I could probably get a coin from this pot as well. Yep. How'd I know? How did I know? I'm a wizard, guys. That's how I knew. More coins, I guess the more upgrades I'll be able to get down the road, so it's definitely worth just snagging as much as I can. Oh. <clears throat> uh oh. Looks like the dwarves are uh getting ready to fight. That's Chief Tane's horn. The warriors are back from raiding. Help's on the way. Let's finish these war borgs and head back. Heck yeah, little one. Heck yeah. Boop. Let's set these guys right back here. And let them come. Oh, wait, there's another one to our left. Ah, uh, that's awkward. I'm gonna go stand over here and just... Ah, oh, I made a mistake, guys. I made a mistake. Please protect me. Ah, oh, this might be... We might be all right. To be fair, I can do this. There you go. We got him. That, that wasn't that bad. What does it say? Mm -hmm. The Snoring Goat Bodil Tavern. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hope everyone everyone's in the in their hiding holes. Gosh, why can't I speak some damn my words? My word. Addy. Oh. Dwarf, there you are. I've been looking for you. Come, come quickly. Your father, he's in trouble. Follow me. Go, go, go. Uh-oh. He's dead. There's a potion right there. How dare you lie to me? You expect me to believe that trolls attacked our village? Trolls? Just bedtime stories meant to scare dwarf children. Do you think I'm a child? Even if these trolls were... <laughs> even if these were trolls, why didn't they turn to stone, huh? Oh. Chief Tane, you must believe me. That was unemotional. Do you think us blind? Look at all these Elvary arrows laying around. Yulga, say you saw the snoring forest at daybreak when to plot with your elf fairy friends, did ya? Oh. I'd never. My son, he. Enough! I can't believe you betray your own people. I have. I'll have your head for this, Eric. Take him away. Uh oh. No, wait, Dad! <laughs> Sound the horns of war. Call upon the warriors of the other clans. We'll take this fight to the elf fairies. Burn their whole forest down. Kings, curse them. I don't know what kind of uh, voice I should put for him, but I feel like I need to put a different voice out. No. Howdy. Dane, as always, Dane always had it in for your father. Ever since your mother chose Eric over him. 
Oh, what are we do going to do? But Grandpa, Tolls really did attack the village. I saw them with my own eyes. I believe you, grandson, but how dare, how have these trolls come to withstand the sunlight? Hmm? We can't worry about that now. You've got to save Eric. Tain is a fool not to trust the, his word. He's a stubborn dwarf, but if you tell him what you saw, he might come to his senses. Uh, that sounds like a bad idea to me, partner. Huh? Okay, we'll come back to that. Uh. Chief Tain, I, I. You're Eric's kid, right? Let me guess, you've come to tell me you saw the trolls with your own eyes, eh? Huh? Yes, I, I have, and they... <laughs> of course you have. <laughs> I'll tell you what. I'm a reasonable dwarf. Bring me proof that trolls exist, and I'll release your father. Hmm. A head for a head. That would do. <laughs> Bring me a troll's head as proof. You have until the next full moon, else your father's head is mine. Ow. What a horrible person. Uh oh. Tain wants a troll's head as proof? Of course he does. Then, my grandson, you must get him one for the sake of both your father and the Alferis. The trolls must still live under Mount Crowcrest. To get into the mountain, you must travel north through the storing forest and find the gates of Crowcrest. Oh, before you go, your father keeps his spare power stone in a chest at the docks. He hid the key nearby. Find it and open the chest. Where you're heading, you'll need every turret you can build. Take care of yourself, grandson. May the kings grant you strength. Thank you, Grandpa. Don't worry. Aerie will keep an eye on me. Mm. Uh, if only I was 20 years younger. Uh, where did he say we could go? I instantly forgot. Oh, gosh. Find Eric's power chest. Uh, <laughs> I honestly don't know where to go, guys. I'm just going to assume it's back here because I think they're in the same house. Right? Nope. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to have a little bit of exploring to do. So far, I'm enjoying this game quite a bit. It's a lot of fun. I, I just wish the controls were a little bit easier. Um, uh, just because, yeah, I don't know. It's a little bit weird. Can I, do I have a map? I don't have a map. Well, that's a little bit of a bummer. Maybe it's over here, yeah? Or maybe it's here, because I haven't actually gone here. Locking bar, nope. Okay, that's a bunch of boats. That's cool. Cool bit of lore. Ooh. Here's the chest. It requires a key. What? Oh my gosh. Why do you troll me like this? It's such a tease. Oh wait, there's the key. I got it, guys. Don't worry. I got the key. Oh, there you go. All right, I think that's it. Addy, we're off. Enter the snoring forest, which I think is this way. Because you did say to the north. Ooh, what is that? Who are you? Your head is mine. Huh? Kidding. Dwarf, who's that? It must be a troll spy. Yeah. Let's hide it down. Cut its head off. Maybe we don't need to go in into the mountain after all. Don't let it escape. I'm going. Don't worry. They'll never escape me with my boots of wisdom speed. Look at us go. We're zooming. You. Yeah. Faster than lightning. Quest complete. Ah, I didn't even read what the quest was. The Snoring Forest. Dwarf. Here we are again, back in the Snoring Forest. Hope I do better than last time. <laughs> you will, before you didn't have the weapons of the ancient warsmiths. And all these power stones, just build as many turrets as you can if any creatures attack us, especially if we run into Shura Shrublins. I hate those flower spiders. Oh, shrublins are flower spiders? Uh-oh. Alrighty. Oh, okay. Uh, my word. Uh, we're good. We got this. That was very abrupt. Oh, I didn't even have my hand on my mouse. I wasn't ready for it. Uh-oh. Bink, bink, bonk. To be fair, I could probably get rid of one of these. I don't think this middle one's gonna do anything, but eventually it will. Don't worry, guys. We got this. I believe in us. Oh, 
Those are slimes, bro. Don't worry. Three times the turrets means three times the work. Aha. No problem. We got this, I believe. A little bit spicy, to be honest. Nice. Uh, we're still trapped in here, so I think there's more that's going to be either spawned or we're forced to go forward. Either way, that is some uh, quite possibility, a distinct possibility. Dob hob. Grr, an intruder. Snorting forest belongs to Groblo and the gro Noblings. We want all your shiny, spinny metal thingies. Give us all your shinies and get out. Those are the Noblings, dwarf. They kill all the dwarves who enter the forest. They won't let us pass without a fight. Watch out for their blow darts. Oh, sheesh, okay. Ah! Get out of here, partner. Oh, do this. Don't worry, we got this. Easy peasy. Uh oh, uh oh, they're getting close. We did take a little bit of damage, I think. My health is white, and I don't know why, but it is. Oh, there's bees over here. Uh oh, ow, ow, that hurt. Ow. No, sir, do not hit me with those things. Oh, we got lots of bees coming in. Oh, jeez. Uh, sir? That's fine. Nice, we got him. Let's go. We got a little bit hurt there. Oh, I see a potion there. What if I can go back for that? Wait a second. That's no troll. You smell like a dwarf. Uh-oh. Sla. Indeed, free one. I am Sly Dwarf. Though I haven't seen these... Been to these parts in many moons. I lured you here for a reason. I'm traveling merchant, you see. I craft mechanisms and devise upgrades for them. Well, I did. Until the noblings stole my tools. Without them, I'm just a vagabond. So, let's hammer a deal. Up this path is Fort Stonewall. The dwarves abandoned it centuries ago. So, noblings moved in and... Made a mess of the place. I tracked that down the noblings that stole my tools to the fort. But it's too heavily guarded. If I if you retrieve my tools, I can upgrade your turrets and traps. What do you say? Huh? Wait. You know how to upgrade the weapons of the warsmiths? <laughs> I've traveled far, deep, and wide, and learned many things along the way. So do we have a deal? Huh. Hmm. Uh, these spin blades do seem a bit dull. Sure, I'll give it a try and get your tools back. Great. May the kings walk with you. Wow, what a sly. What a sly folk. Let me see if I can go back really quick and grab that. It doesn't appear as though I can. Whoops. I wonder if I'll leave these behind if I, like, forever, if they're forever lost. Nope, okay. I was testing a couple things. I was testing if my boomerang could grab that. Um, that was also a big no. Ow! Oh my gosh! This was, it was, that was a fast, that was a fast, uh, turnaround. Holy butterscotch. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I'm really hurt or really healthy. My goodness. Okay, I gotta be prepared. My word. Okay, there's a potion there for us. Hey, those shanies belong to Grabble, you stinky dwarf thief. Huh? What the heck is, what the heck is Grabble? Huh? Like a gerbil. Wait, I have full health? No, wait. How do I use how do I use this? Huh? Hold up, there's gotta be a control for it, right? Dash, interact, recall. Maybe not. Uh I definitely don't have full health. If you look in the bottom right corner. Um did anyone see how to use potions? I'm just gonna spam through my keys really quick and pretend that um I'm going to use a potion. Doesn't appear as such. 
So if it says I have full health, I guess I have full health. Oh, I have the armor, right? I never even I never even finished using the armor. That's what it is. Uh oh. Right there. Boom. Bingo. Haha. You'll never. Ow! He just stabbed me. What a punk. Stay back. Stay back, you foul beasts. There you go. We got this. Don't worry. Uh oh. I believe in us, guys. Stand right here. Tap him into infinity and beyond. Ow. This one guy is annoying. Oh, what the heck is that? Uh oh. Sorry, that guy died instantly. Could have probably done this differently. Yo, dude, this guy needs to, needs to rip in pepperoni. Okay, still full health, so lucky me. What's in the cavern? Uh oh. Checkpoint reached. Nobling shield? Hold up. No, hold. Yeah, if you notice that, uh, okay, first of all, I don't have a cursor up, but it actually looks as though, um, my guy is like trying to get cursorified. Okay, so he is blocking. I think that means I have to do a little bit more in terms of tactics. He was tanky, eh? Let's see what's up here. Oh, looks like a, uh, a puzzle, eh? Gotcha. Oh, that opens the this door. Oh, this makes sense. I don't know why my brain couldn't figure it out before. More armor, beautiful. Don't even have to use a potion. Easy mode. Easy mode. Already. Uh oh, uh, uh. Stay back. Yeah, we got him. Don't worry. We're good. Those guys, it's so spooky. Oh, who are you? Stop right there, dwarf. What are you doing in the snoring forest? I, I, I don't want to fight a halfling. I'm following a band of trolls that raided my village. So that's what these monsters are. I've been tracking them ever since they came from the mountain. I'm Mia of the Crimson Moon Guild. I must be off. My headman want, want to know of this. Raven's luck to you, dwarf. Wow, that's cool. Aha, I knew it. Coins and coins and more coins. Coins for me. Coins for you. Coins for us all. That's a dwarvy thing, right? Ah, uh, okay. What if I do this? Ah, oh, that's easy. Obviously, those just put those spikes back up, I'm sure. Or the walls back up, whatever you want to call them. Dude, this is, this is a pretty awesome game so far. I like it. What is this? It's dwarven made, but I've never seen a statue like this. Of course, you're fascinated by a hunk of stone. <laughs> Must be a remnant from the ancient kingdom. Dude. What up? <laughs> so cool. Okay, let's see. The fort is closed, but, but be careful. Nobling guards use shields to block arrows. Your crossbow turrets is useless against them. Okay. Pesky noblings have always hide their stolen treasures in high places. I'll meet you north of the fort once you have my tools. Kings go with you. Okay, well, uh, it looks like there could be goodies in this area. I'm not gonna worry too heavily about it. I'm just gonna kind of peek around. Whoa, look at all those vicious noblings. Okay. I think I know how to fight these guys. I think I'm gonna use the tar and the uh and the spin traps. 
the dwarf, are you sure about this? That's a lot of dwarf eating noblings. Yeah, I have to. Dad's life depends on me getting into Mount Crowcrest. And I need Slaw to upgrade my turrets if I'm to stand a chance against trolls. Okay. Let's prepare. Here we go. Huh? Nani? There you go. I'll put a trap right here. A precautionary measure. Never mind, they're far away. Oh, I put the wrong one down. That's awkward. Ow. Give him back. Ow. Ow. Oh my god, ow. I'm making mistakes, guys. I'm making mistakes. Oh god. <laughs> See that? Get lit up, sir. We have to replace this trap up here. Sucker! What up? Ow, that was painful. Okay. Uh, we didn't even lose our shield though, so luckily, lucky us, eh? Oh, what's up here? Oh my gosh, I can go in. I didn't think I was gonna be able to go in. There are old dwarven runes on this stone plate tablet. I can read them. Good, good. Huh. All those long, boring lessons with Espen were useful after all. We raise stone wall in defeat and exile. Ah, the runes are badly scratched. To stand as a bulk work, trolls overcome the sun. Can't make out the rest. Oh, they overcame the sun, eh? So let's see, stone wall in defeat and exile. Um, interesting. Seems like noblings don't share your love of history. <laughs> um, I want to go up, but I also want to take out this guy over here because I know that there's this guy down here first. Okay, we're good. Don't worry about it. We got it. We're golden. What's in here? Treasures and goodies. It appears really quick. Can I grab this? No, nope, I can't. Okay. Um, what about here? Anything? Anything for me to snag up? Nope. But a pathway down. I feel like a pathway down is always the right way to go first, right? There's uh, noblings over there. Okay, that opens up. Interesting, interesting. I'm sure this is going to be a puzzle. A proper puzzle. Might I add. Okay. And what about this? <clears throat> nice. Okay, so the one up top did that. Okay, and this one does nothing. This one does that. And this last one does the last one. Okay, the puzzle's not too complicated, which is good. Thank you. So far, the puzzles really haven't been very complicated. They've just been like, oh, just go this way and do this. And you do that and you're good. <laughs> so I'm down. Oh, this is, there is a way up. Okay. Yeah. So I guess we're going up on this side first. I definitely put them in the wrong order, guys. Don't mind me. Nice potion. Whoops. He's dead, don't worry. Okay, we got potions lying everywhere. I'm interested to see how this game um, saves though. Okay, there's the chest over there. So obviously I can't grab it just yet. Huh? I'm interested to see how this game saves, guys. Hopefully it's a smooth and seamless save and nothing complicated or uh, horrible. Uh, let's, let's actually pick it up. We got this. Ow. That's through. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're about to start taking actual damage. Hopefully I can learn this game a little bit faster and uh, not have to worry about taking actual damage. Okay. 
I'm pressing, literally just spamming all the buttons. <laughs> Trying to figure it out. Like, uh, how do I do this? Nice. Let's go. I don't know why I'm not dashing more. Also, I don't know if you guys noticed it, but I can dash diagonally. Yep. Diagon Alley. Here we go. Yeah, I know I have full health. You silly game. What's in the box? Oh, of course, Snowblings hide tools in a chest. They're shiny. Yeah. Let's head up north. Can't wait to see what upgrades Slaw has. Alrighty. Bada bing, bada boom. I wish it showed the tools. I think that'd have been a nice little touch. Also, I wish I could dash more than once. Like, it uses up all my energy, I get it, but... Ah, I don't know, it's kind of a drag. Alrighty. My tools, finally. Thank you, Dwarf. Looks like King's Grace has kept you safe. Now, use my workbench bench to purchase upgrades for your turrets and traps, but I will need scrap to craft and perform the upgrades. Nice, I've been collecting it for you, lady. Oh, there you go. Okay, what is this? Spin blade turret. Health 300, damage 16 points. Okay, I mean, that's not bad, but I'll be honest, I'm gonna go for range. If I can do, if I can upgrade range, I'm gonna be fuego. Muy muy fuego. Uh, hold up. This is 20 to buy an upgrade. Okay. Increases damage by two. Health 120, damage 15. What are these guys? Health 45 seconds. Oh, they're timed. Okay. Um, no damage. Tar will cover enemies that walk over it. Short duration. What if I do this? No, I just... Oh, okay. I think if I use my arrow keys... Yeah, if I use my arrow keys, I can actually go through it without um, doing that. Okay, so that just upgrades the time. This does increase his health by 30. This is increases damage, which I'm totally down for. Let's upgrade that. What other upgrades do we have here? Poison arrows deals 3 damage every 3 seconds for 5 seconds. That's pretty awesome. Um... Increases fire rate by 10%. Increase uh, turrets take 50% less damage from arrows and darts. Okay. For now, we're just going to leave that one upgrade and be good. Also, I think this is a wonderful spot to call it for the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a comment rate and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Hope you guys, hope to see you there. Peace out, everybody. Adios.